I'm, I'm sure there will be uh, less accidents and less, less deaths. The debate about reducing residential roads to a limit of 40 kilometers per hour hit City Hall Monday, with some saying that data is clear and others advocating for a plebiscite this fall. Ward 1 councillor Ward Sutherland is in favour of reducing the speed limits and says Calgary is already behind cities like Vancouver, Edmonton and Toronto. Uh, we're one of the last to join. Advocates like Bike Calgary are completely on board and agree reducing speed limits means reducing cyclist and pedestrian deaths. But some councillors, like Jeremy Farkas, want Calgarians to decide this fall in a plebiscite, something that Bike Calgary isn't buying. They're essentially advocating for a no, but they want to shirk the responsibility. And Sutherland agrees. Getting people all emotional about it uh, is really a disservice and, and, and I find it very disappointing. A plebiscite environment would just invite a lot of misinformation uh, and also a lot of passion feelings. One of the points of contention here is that not all city streets would be affected. This is a residential street. It would be affected. This is a collector road that feeds into those residential streets. It goes 50 kilometers per hour and it's not a part of this debate, although there are some that say it should be. There's children playing in the yards on these streets. There's seniors walking up and down the sidewalks, accessing parks. Sutherland says that may be up for discussion in the future, but for right now, he expects the vote tomorrow to be a yes to the residential street reduction. We have to balance those views. Kara Campbell, City News, Calgary.